many Treasure Valley families, going to the movie theater is a standard weekend pastime. But for one local family, the movies aren't a pastime, they're a way of life. In this week's Made in Idaho, we hop on Highway 2026, head west, and don't stop until we pull in to the Parma Motor View. It's pretty much my baby, aside from my family. A short 30 minute drive from Nampa, you'll find Karen Cornwell's baby, the Parma Motor View, one of the area's last surviving drive in movie theaters. Though this baby is now over 65 years old. In 1953, television had come to the valley and it was turning the movie industry upside down. And my dad, thought a drive-in theater would help combat television. So Cornwell's dad and mom built the Parma icon in the 50s and operated it until 1976, which is when Cornwell and her husband took over. I've been here ever since. <laughs> so has the theater's famous popcorn machine, which Cornwell says is one of the theater's biggest draws. Probably the highlight of this place is our popcorn machine. It's the original. It's 66 years old, still popping the best corn in the valley. And while the popcorn hasn't changed much over the decade, Cornwell says the industry's technology sure has, and her drive-in right along with it. From its infancy in delicate film. Film used to be very fragile. It could break. A bad splice could just tear the machine up. To its adolescence with what Cornwell calls the big reel. Which was a little bit easier because you weren't going back and forth, back and forth. To now the all grown up digital age. We're going to walk out that door and at, at 940, boom, it's going to light up and we'll have a picture on the screen. It does have a few issues if you don't know what you're doing. Cornwell's entire family has grown up at the Motor View with all of her children and now seven of her grandchildren having worked at the theater. They became very involved and became best friends because of the drive-in. These days, Cornwell is getting ready to hang up the film reel for good, but don't worry, the drive-in is in good hands. Enjoy the movies, guys. Cornwell's daughter, Susan Aheim, is getting ready to take over the ticket booth. And uh, I am more than thrilled to be able to pass it on in the family. Haheim says as she grew up working at the drive-in and has fond memories of watching her grandfather bust would-be rule breakers. Remember being at the ticket booth and having my grandfather <laughs> ask people to open the trunk because people are trying to sneak in. <laughs> if there were people in there, he'd make them pay. <laughs> Neither mother nor daughter can quite put their finger on what makes the drive-in such a draw for Treasure Valley families. They just know it's never lost its family-friendly appeal. People bring their kids out and they camp, they have chairs and couches and ugh, you name it. And they say that won't change even with a changing of the guard. It's just an amazing place. It's magical. That's so fun. Yeah. So the drive in, it always offers a double feature on movie oh, night. Cool. So plan on a long night yeah. because the first movie doesn't start till around dusk, of course, yeah. when it's getting dark, right? And right now the movies are playing only on weekends. The summer starts to wind down, but you can check the full movie schedule by visiting this uh, story on our website yeah. later this morning. I just looked yeah. this weekend. It's Mamma Mia 2 and Mission Impossible. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> what a combo. My favorite <laughs> thing about this theater, though, is you can bring your dog, too. Yes. They'll let oh, you bring cool. your dog. Yeah. No charge, hopefully. Dog. Yeah, no kidding. <laughs> as long as grandpa's not around. That's right, yeah. <laughs> Don't hide in the trunk, they'll get you. Um, and they say people have brought couches out like in the backs of their trucks and they set them out. It's just a great family oh, friendly. Fun. And they choose family friendly movies too. They're very careful yeah. about that. So yeah. it's good yeah. for everybody. I really feel like that's just an, an old piece of like 50s, 60s, 70s bringing yeah. it here. Yeah. Yeah. What yeah. a cool thing to Isn't see. Isn't that fun? It's yeah. so fun. All right.